Come on. Guys. Guys. Hey, oh, knock. Just, I'm sorry. Hey, there's a young lady getting I'm sorry. Okay, here. I'm sorry. I was just... The letter. It came the interview letter. I got it. I did. I got oh, it. Oh, my God. That's prom night. She knows what that means. So, I guess I'll be seeing you at 7 o'clock tonight? Yeah, I just have to pick up your corsage, and, and then I'll be there. Okay. <laughs> Great. See, I need to ask a favor, man. I'm supposed to pick up a corsage at the flower shop. Come on in. I'm gonna make a quick pit stop. It's on the way. I was just getting a lift. Appears we have a bigger problem on our hands, Mr. Reyes. See, so you're not showing up in any of our databases. It's almost as if you don't exist. We're gonna be holding you over for immigration services. Read the form before you sign it. I can't voluntarily deport myself. There's no way. You don't have a choice. You're either gonna be incarcerated here or walk free in Mexico, your home. This is my home. Not anymore, pal. Yeah, I was told to talk to you in regards to Alejandro Reyes. He had a two o'clock. He has been deported. This kid, this very good, very loving kid, is right now on a bus to Mexico, a country he's never been to, by the way, without having any due process, without having a lawyer. You're the ADA, Mr. James. What the hell are you going to do about it? Hey, my name is Alex. We were on the same bus together. Lucky you. As I've seen kids in the States come down here, get stuck, chewed up, spit out in a matter of days. That is my culpa. Te quiero. I love you too. I miss you so much. Stop worrying about me, okay? I have to take care of myself. This is the worst place in the world. It, it's horrible. You, like me, we don't belong in this place. We could die at any minute. No one on this side of the border would give a damn, okay? Is it dangerous? You sleep just one tiny little bit, and you can in case you ask why. I think your skin is crazy, and it's going to get you killed. 